My name is Jajun David Lai. I'm currently a second year student uh, in the master's program, piano performance. I lost my sight at a very early age and I could only play with toys that could make sounds at the very first. When I was three, my parents bought me a toy electronic keyboard. And it was then that I started to explore kind of making sounds and things like that. I attended Brevard Music Center in 2018. It is a summer uh, festival and institute. And there I met Professor Michael Shirtok. And I was told that there was a student from Beijing Central Conservatory with a great deal of talent, and he was going to be in my studio there. And I couldn't wait to hear him. And he played with an enormous amount of passion and knowledge. I knew that he would be looking for a graduate school and thought, where better could he really develop his abilities and grow in his artistry than CCM? He told me about CCM. And my first impressions of working with him was that he had great attention to the details and intricacies uh, um, of the music, of the score that we were working with. And he was able to let me know and inform me of this detail in an accessible and understanding way. Being a totally blind musician, to actually get this insight from him that really felt wonderful. One of the things that's kind of unique, and uh, it could be partially attributed to the fact that he is visually disabled, everything David plays is from memory. A lot of us pianists, memorizing music is extremely important, and we like kind of, once you've memorized a piece, it's like putting it in a pressure cooker and the ingredients start to really interact with each other. This pretty much begins with David right from the start. Music is a, a force for unity and, and common purpose and common good. And I think it has made uh, CCM really an international conservatory. Being an international student, I know that I can also add color, and uh, different points of view as I, as I am here. Um, I love to be able to have a community around me. I love studying here. I love working with my professors. And I also love making friends with uh, fellow classmates and studio mates and uh, other musicians of different disciplines and majors. One of the kindest things a student did was uh, one of our graduate students who works in the college office from uh, Michigan discovered that David was fond of the music of John Williams and she transcribed from him a whole bunch of information she found on the internet so that on his e-reader he could uh, enjoy these things and he thought wow that must say a lot about the character of the students here. The coronavirus has definitely impacted me uh, to certain degrees. Uh, classes being online definitely is uh, something that I feel is very important. I have had to work with professors on alternative ways of being accessible or making the learning content accessible to me as a totally blind student. I am receiving financial assistance to attend CCM. This financial assistance is important to me personally um, because had it been otherwise, if I didn't receive any financial assistance, I might have to rethink about whether or not to come to America to study. My donation to CCM begins an amazing web of relationships that often go down through generations. I would say, first of all, thank you so much for helping me as an individual here. You have definitely um, made me take one step closer to being a musician, to being a performer. I feel that a person who makes a contribution to the College Conservatory, it's a gift you can't predict where its limit is going to be. It's, the potential is too vast and complex and amazing. I think this is also sort of a gener generational thing that once you receive help, you give back. And I think that's what I hope to do in the future as well. Thank you.